I'm Ray Johnston for Tech Life, and I'm here with the first 3D printer that's come into our labs. The Up Mini from 3D Printing Systems is the first affordable 3D printer to land in Australia. I'm here with Darren Yates, Tech Life's contributing editor, chief reviewer and 3D printing guru. Darren, what makes this one of the more exciting things that you've seen come through the Tech Life Labs? Well, it's the first 3D printer we've seen come in at around the $1,000 mark, and that's amazing value given what you're actually getting, a device that prints 3D objects. So having one in the home, what sort of things can you print for yourself at home? Oh, it's, it really is a case of what can you imagine printing. Um, these use um, ABS plastic, which is a plastic that appears in just about every room of the house mm. in all sorts of devices. You can print everything from McDonald's toys through to <laughs> casework for little computers. Um, if you're a design student, you're going to be you're going to be going to school the next day and saying, "Where is ours? Where yeah. is our printer?" Because you can anything you can design, you can basically print. The way the Up Mini works is simple. It connects to your computer just like a regular printer. You can create the 3D design yourself or you can go to websites such as Thingiverse where you can download from thousands of different pre-made models. You calibrate the printer, then you load the design into the software that comes with the printer. Click OK and you're good to go. What it's doing now is dividing the job into multiple horizontal layers and it's sending those layers to the printer. So you can print anything. Could you print a gun? Technically, yeah, you can print a gun. If the printer is the right size, at this stage, this print is probably a bit small, um, but there are, there are plans on the internet that you can download and print your own gun. So, wow. <laughs> so there could be quite significant legal oh, holes and ramifications. Oh, all sorts of things. I mean, if you think about it, you've, you've now got a device that you can print things. So you could print copies of things. It's going to create all sorts of legal issues. There's no two ways about it. That you can now print out copies of other devices. If you can get the plans, if you can get somebody to create the model inside 3D modeling software and you can download it to the printer and you can print it out, you can print something that could well be copyrighted somewhere else by someone else. So this is the future? It seems that way, it certainly does. <laughs> um, some, I mean, the amazing thing for me is that it's basically not much bigger than a bread maker. It sits on your desk and plugs into your computer's USB port and makes 3D objects that you can hold. So whatever you can imagine, you can now hold. It's just, that's just mind blowing. 